machine learning with python in this session i am going to uh, teach how to handle missing values in uh, for pandas so before that i'll show uh, what is series series is a one dimensional labeled array which is capable of holding data of any type be it integer be it string be it so, uh, float or any other objects and the access level are collectively called index so let's start will import the libraries suppose we are saying the name of the series is series 1 is equal to td the object of pandas uh, dot now we are creating the series which is nothing but one dimensional array so we will say will and it can contain uh, all the all kind of uh, data types right so we'll say suppose integer float text then we will give Oh, we have not executed this package now it should go fine yeah now when we are dealing with the missing values the two functions which we will uh, it will help us are is null and not null and please note both the function returns returns boolean both the upper functions return boolean true or false suppose if you want to uh, check something like series 1 dot is null so you can see it is returning the boolean values now if we give so based on the condition the output will be whether it's true if it is a null then we want to see which one is null so only the value which is null will be true the rest everything will be false and if we want to check for not null in that case for the subscription values like the first value of array second value third value of array here as per this uh, array uh, series it is true the fourth one contains nan not a number it is false and again the last one has a value apple so it's true so i just wanted to give you a basic understanding of this i'll give i'll show you one more uh, thing and then we'll start with pandas how to deal with that uh, also in this case if we give here dot sum you can see only one element is there which is null and if we give here dot sum there are four element which is not null okay so the series thing the basic concept of series i have given how to deal with uh, not a concept the basic concept of handling a series with null values now we will uh, see how to handle missing values so the similarly we'll uh, import our data set the train data set which we have okay so this is done now you, the basic operations you can just check and give and check dot info data set dot info now as per this sex uh, the age column 
it has null values then we have a uh, cabin which also has null values and we have embarked the from which stations from which port people have boarded the ship so now let's start we'll de uh, we'll uh, deal with the h column we'll manipulate it if we give is null is null dot head if we give what we get execute it control enter as we know just highlight this sentence and then control enter okay this is because the it should be inside this was an error it should be here this bracket and we we are just dealing with the data set age okay so that was like we have that was a typo we will again Now you can see the age column here. It contains not a number, right? Data set. If you want to see the uh, the first five, which is not null, in that case we'll see. Okay, so you can see age column is it contains value, and whereas if you see here, here the age con age age column contains not a number. Now, what happen if we try to replace uh, n n value with some other uh, like some uh, some values with n n values, right? What happens if if we try to replace some value with n n? So we have our data set. Uh, data set. We will deal with the sex column, suppose, and we want to replace the female column with and then suppose so how will it behave What do you think this this will work? This will not work because n is is not defined, and uh, n n is defined with it's a member of the library numpy. So if you want to execute it, we have to give here np dot n n. Okay. Now, if we execute it, so if you want to see data set, dot info, see, the sex column initially it was around, it was not empty, right? Everything was there, all the data was there initially. Yeah, initially, if you see the sex column has 891 values, but now after we after the transformation, we have uh, replaced the female uh, values with not a number. Now we have uh, we are left with only 577 values. So, so this is the way how we can replace a value and how we can uh, like play with n n. 
and how to deal with uh, not a number so thank you for watching this session if you find this session helpful please like the press the like button and subscribe to this channel thanks a lot and i'll be coming with com coming up with some more videos